hello my dear friends welcome back to my channel already now six days left for the examination this is mathematics subject bmat series of the first semester if you have a backlog in this particular subject today i am with the problem solving video especially this is the question uh, that i think seven marks question in the video examination right mclaren series as uh, most of the students were telling me that make a video on the mclaren series right so my dear friends this is a very simpler one if you just focus on you have to just remember the formula as you already know in the engineering you should remember the formulas and uh, the proof part is not yours just because nobody no no engineering student wants the proof over there so they just want the formulas by which they can tackle the questions right so let me explain this formula so that it will be crystal clear for you people to solve this particular problem right so this is y double dash then x cube upon 3 factorial y triple dash of 0 my dear friends this is a, suppose a function y of x so you have to give the initial condition that means you have to put x value as 0 firstly then y dash of 0 means you have to differentiate the first function let me uh, later on i will tell you once i will solve the question this is the formula which you can easily remember i think so first of all y of uh, y of 0 initial condition plus x upon 1 factorial so then you have to differentiate the first function then you have to put the value of x is equal to 0 again then x square like it will increase x x square x cube and y dash of 0 y double dash of 0 y triple y triple dash of 0 so i think it is very easy to remember my dear friends no need to worry about it i hope you will do it right so this is the function now y of x is given it is given in the question expand the function e of x using mclaren series right so i will just write y of x is equal to e of x right so first of all i have to calculate y of 0 means you have to put the value of x as 0 so i can write y of 0 sorry i will write here so y of 0 is equal to e raised power x x value you have to put 0 so e raised power 0 anything raised power 0 is equal to 1 so we got the value y of 0 right then you have to calculate this y dash of 0 so how you can calculate y dash of 0 is equal to means sorry first of all i will write y dash of x just because i have to differentiate the above equation so what is the differentiation of e power x you already know it uh, the differentiation of e, e x is always e raised power x you should remember it if you don't know also you have to remember this differentiation of e raised power x is always e raised power x right now you have to calculate y dash of 0 at 0 again you have to calculate that is e raised power 0 which will again be 1 right next step is this was the two step then y double dash of 0 how how can we calculate y double dash of 0 y double dash of x you have to again differentiate this particular function so e raised power x uh, if you differentiate again it will again be uh, again e raised power x so you have to check y double dash of 0 is equal to e raised power 0 again right it will be 1 for every value of x it will be 1 in case of the e raised power x in next question we will see the procedure again so in this problem it is coming 1 1 and 1 now you have to put these values in the particular formula right so let me put it first of all y of x is given what is it e raised power x okay which is equal to y of 0 you have calculated here y of 0 is equal to 1 plus x upon 1 factorial right then y dash of 0 you have already calculated here y dash of 0 is all also 1 so if i multiply it with 1 so it will be x by 1 factorial right plus no need to write the 1 over here then x square upon 2 factorial okay then y double dash of 0 y double dash of 0 you have already calculated 1 again so no need to multiply just because it will be the same term right then plus x cube upon 3 factorial it will go on like this so 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 on this will be your mclaren series for the e power x so this is your question it's a very simpler one my dear friends if you are worrying about this i think uh, there is no rocket science in this particular uh, what we call series over here so this is the only procedure for this particular problem let us solve another problem now so dear friends next question is expand the uh, function under root of 1 plus sine 2x using mclaren series so mclaren series is already given you should remember it now uh, uh, y of x is given right so i will write here y of x is equal to under root of 1 plus sine 2x it is given my dear friends right so as you already know you should be uh, known these formulas as uh, pu is concerned if you have just come across these formulas like uh, sine square x plus cos square 
x is equal to, is always equal to 1 this is the one formula for the from the trigonometry part and another formula is sin 2x sorry sin 2x is equal to 2 sin x cos x this is the formula these two formulas you need in this particular question so what uh, can i write instead of this one i can write sin square x plus cos square x instead of this one okay this is the formula so instead of one i am writing this formula sin square x plus cos square x okay then sin 2x it is again a formula that is 2 sin x cos x so 2 sin x cos x over here right <clears throat> as if you are observing here this is the formula a square plus b square plus 2 times a b a b is this so a square plus b square plus 2 a b it is already you know over there so this is sin x a plus b sin x whole square a square plus b square plus 2 a b is equal to a plus b whole square this square and root will get cancelled what will remain here sin x plus cos x is your function now so this is your y of x okay are you getting my point do let me know in the comment section my dear friends if you are understanding right this is uh, now you have to calculate y of zero that is you have to put the value of x as zero then you can calculate y of zero okay this will uh, you will get sine of zero plus cos of zero over here right so sine zero is already zero plus cos zero is one so you will get y of zero as one over here right this is one value now y dash of uh, y dash of 0 you have to calculate first of all we will calculate y dash of x with this uh, particular function is given you we have to differentiate this particular function right so let me differentiate it it will become y dash of x is equal to what is the differentiation of sin x it is cos x okay plus sin what is the uh, differentiation of cos x minus uh, minus co uh, sorry sin x over here right you have to just put the values now instead of x you have to put 0 you will get y dash of 0 so it will become cos of 0 minus sine of 0 okay so cos 0 is 1 minus sine 0 is 0 so you are getting again y of y dash of 0 is equal to 1 over here right then you have to differentiate this function so that you will get y double dash of z, uh, sorry y double dash of x uh, what is the differentiation of cos x minus sine x okay minus what is the differentiation of sine x that is cos of x now you have to put down the value uh, what is the value of sine uh, sorry this is sine 0 minus cos of 0 so y double dash of 0 you are getting here uh, sine 0 is 0 no need to write minus cos 0 is 1 so this is minus 1 over here right so similarly you have to go for uh, y triple dash of x y 4 times it will be mentioned in the question up to which uh, uh, which uh, term you have to go for the this particular series right so to, uh, in this particular question I am taking only the uh, up to three terms over here right so i will just put down these values in the particular formula it will become y of y of x is already given in the question that is one plus sine of 2x which is equal to y of zero calculated here that is one plus x upon one factorial okay uh, y dash of zero y dash of zero is already one so if i multiply uh, with one it will be the same term no need to write here right so plus x square upon 2 factorial okay y double dash of 0 is uh, minus 1 over here right so if i multiply this term with minus 1 so it will become minus so similarly it will go on uh, like this so so on so this will be your mclaren series for this particular case over here so similarly you can write here x cube upon 3 factorial so this is your expansion for this 1 plus sine 2x so this is all about the mclaren series so you have to try some three to four questions from this particular series so that you will easily get seven marks in this uh, question over here so thanks for watching my video